The last video illustrated the concepts of series and parallel equivalents, voltage division and current division circuits and source transformations and they were used to analyze the latter circuits of the type we did earlier. Now the basic analysis strategy is to reduce the circuit to simpler equivalent in which the output is easily found by a current or voltage division or Ohm's law. However there's no fixed pattern in the reduction process and much depends on the insight of the analyst. However in any case the circuit reduction we work directly with the circuit model and so the process gives us insight into circuit behavior. So let's analyze this ladder circuit using series and parallel equivalents to find this output voltage VO as well as the current IS, our input current IS here. So first of all we want to reduce this circuit with an equivalent resistance and we note that it's 2R and R are connected in parallel so R equivalent for the first case here is that 2R product of the two resistors in parallel divided by the sum of the two resistors in parallel and that yields two-thirds R. Okay, Since we're trying to find VO, so before we reduce the circuit even further to find IS, we need to do a voltage division. So VO is equal to our input voltage VS, the voltage across this resistor, parallel resistor combination is just simply two-thirds R. So two-thirds R divided by R plus, since this is in series with this R, two-thirds R, which is equal to VS two-thirds R is in the numerator and five-thirds R is in the denominator and that yields two-fifths VS for VO. Okay, note when we reduce the circuit we have this voltage divider VS this plus minus, this is R corresponding to this R and we replace with with R equivalent R equivalent 1 as 2 thirds R and we took this circuit and evaluated VO. Now to find uh, IS we need to simplify this even further and reduce this circuit so that VS plus minus here and then we just simply, these, since these are connected in series, that's just R equivalent to, let me uh, clean this up a little bit, and go back here, and draw this circuit. So R equivalent to is just add these two resistors, which is just R plus two-thirds R or five-thirds R. So that's R equivalent to. And then when we want to find IS, okay, IS therefore results in uh, IS using Ohm's law is the voltage of the source divided by the equivalence five-thirds R which is equal to three-fifths Vs divided by R. Note that since we wanted to find the output voltage we had to do that first in this circuit before we eliminated node B to find our desired IS. So our answer to this equation is that circuit is that VO is equal to two-fifths Vs and IS is three-fifths Vs over R. So let's analyze this example using circuit reduction. Here we want to use a source transformation to find the output voltage VO shown here and the input current IS shown here. 
and we notice we labeled X and Y terminals shown here so we can convert this ideal voltage source in series with this resistor R into a current source since we want to find IS. However, first we note this 2R and R are connected in parallel, these two resistor combination. So we can say that this equivalent resistance for this case here, R equivalent for the first case is just 2R times R over R plus 2R which is just equal to two-thirds R. Now we know we can use a transformation. We gotta be cautious of IS when we do this. So we have to say that this current source is really VS divided by R, which is in parallel with this R, and this is our current IS. Now we can replace this equivalent resistance with two-thirds R. Alright, so here's our IS shown here. And now we need to find the current IS. Well, we can use current division, which is the opposite resistor, which is R and then the sum of those two, which is just two-thirds R plus R. And we have a current source of Vs divided by R. Well, this is just equal to Vs divided by R, three-fifths Vs divided by R. So now that we have the current source, we can find the output voltage, which is just this parallel combination, two-thirds R, times our current through here. Because that's what our voltage output from this for this equivalent circuit, where we have plus minus VO. But this is just two-thirds R times IS, and we just calculated that. So VO is just using Ohm's law, we have two-thirds R times IS, which is three-fifths VS divided by R. The R's cancel, the threes cancel, and we're left with two-fifths VS. That's our final answer.